Men have to understand that, that a lot of women are jealous of them. I know it's, you know, it's hard to comprehend some of the things that the devil, you know, put inside these women's minds. Because, you know, he's the author of confusion. You know, he was jealous of Jesus. So jealousy comes from the devil. But there's a lot of women that's jealous of, of men's confidence, um, self-control, material possessions, and stuff like that. It may be some men that's jealous of women also, but I'm talking about the women. I'm a man, so. And I just, this is something that's new to me because I didn't know that women were jealous of men. I just didn't know. And uh, if they see no, if they see that you have um, supreme confidence in your eyes and you show no interest in them, they'll like you no matter how monstrous you think you look or if you do look it's not about your looks it's all about your energy your confidence your mindset it's a lot of guys that look like monsters that's that's got gorgeous women sucking the dirt out their toes um yeah a lot of them jealous man it was a girl seeing, watching me play one-on-one -on -one yesterday. Um, I've witnessed a lot, a lot of jealous encounters in like the past two years when I first figured out about it. A lot of, a lot of guys that's, um, that I consult with, they tell me of stories of, of jealous women also that's jealous of them, of all kinds of stuff. They money, confidence, they, they work, a little superficial stuff. They mainly jealous of superficial stuff, but it can be stuff in, that's dealing with your personality, like your um, confidence, your um your mentality, your patience level. They want to see you get mad. They want to see you get out of order. They're jealous of your self-control. They want to see how you act when things, you know. They want to see if they can press your button. So they're jealous of who, you. It's almost like they're jealous that we got hand bones and they got yammies. Um, I was on the court. I was with, hanging out with a girl yesterday. And um, I was on, you know, we and I wanted to play basketball. I really didn't want to hang out with her for real. I Part of me kind of did, but then... But I went to the court. Went to the court. I was able to play one on one, and she was watching, you know. And this dude, he had me like eight one. We was going to thirteen or twelve. He had me like eight one, man. He couldn't. He wasn't missing. So I got that down and started netting it. Pow, 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 pow. I caught right back up with him there, just so I can seal the win. I was bigger than him, you know. So I, you know, I put that body on him and hit that. Uh, and won the game. So we played like three games. I won all of them. I was going to let him win the last one, but my mind started thinking about something else. I forgot that I was going to let him win. And I ended up winning that game too. But he was up. All three games, he was up. You know, at first, I guess he thought I was, some, you know, sorry because he was playing with some like, um, some flip flops or something. So, and he was still winning. He wasn't missing. But then he put his shoes on, like, you know, and then I still beat him. But, um, you know, she was just looking at me while I was playing. I noticed every time I looked over there, she was just looking at me. <laughs> she was just looking at me, just looking at me. She was just looking at me. And then when it was over, I said, yeah, man, I had, I couldn't let him beat me in no flip-flops. And she was like, yeah, um, yeah, you can shoot, um, it's your shot, it's your shot, um, and then she was like, she was like belittling me, like kind of like belittling. I'm like, what are you doing? I beat three games. What are you talking about? I said, she said, yeah, but he he couldn't shoot it. Something he couldn't shoot. The dude could shoot because he almost beat three times. I just caught back up. And uh, he was like, yeah, it is, you know, if it's because you put you also you came down there and you start muscle. I'm like, this is basketball. We're going to do what we have to do and what's come easy. I can shoot and I'm strong. And I can go down there and put my sh put my body and my strength on it to get the easy shot. And then I was like, the object of the game is to put that ball in the bucket. What you talking about? So they always want to test you. And she was jealous. They jealous. A lot of these women want to get with us successful men. 
us guys that's making a couple hundred thousand a year or a million a year or a couple million or a lot of million, they want to get with us because they jealous of us. They jealous and they looking for the moment to see us at our lowest moment. A lot of these women don't have us in our best image. They'll give up the yammy, they'll give up the cheeks, let us smash and all that. But they jealous. And 93% of the women out here are jealous. Look at the, the, check out the divorce rate and look who's filing for divorce. Not because the man cheated, because they just wanted to file for divorce. They never loved them in the first place. They jealous of your comfort level. They jealous of your assurance with yourself. They jealous of everything. We live in a very jealous world where women are jealous of men. Be careful who you choose to share your money with, who you choose to share your time with. Be careful who you choose to put your hand bone in. Just because she look good, she can be a devil in a good looking body. I pray for all y'all brothers out there, man. Be careful, man. Let's go, we got to keep these, uh, keep these women lonely, bro. Keep them lonely. Tell them no. Keep them lonely. They don't love, they don't love us, man. Most of them don't, 93% of them.